Dr. Hubner, Natural Transplants. I'm here with Mette Yena. She's one of our rock stars here at the clinic. She's one of uh, our, our many patients that do blogs uh, personally on her own. And by the way, she's not affiliated with our clinic in terms of uh, there's no contract or anything. This is something that she wanted to do uh, to help other people. She kind of understands what it is to go through the research to find the information you're looking for and, and she's sort of paying it forward to help other people. But she has had two procedures and on her blog, on her YouTube channel, you can see the whole process from one procedure to two procedures. She's been very, very good at giving people uh, updates every couple months about, even every month, I think, uh, for the progress. So uh, it's like watching grass grow, I know, but look at her final result. I'll put some before pictures there, but. Mentiana, tell us about your your journey from beginning to end. I mean, tell us, you know, what you think. So I think that I I am very glad that I decided to embark on this journey. After my first hair transplant, I was very happy. I was excited. I got a hairline back, which I never thought I could have a hairline back. Yeah. So I had it back, and I figured. I'm still young. Let me go ahead and do the second one and have it out of the way. Yeah. And I'm glad I did the second one because now that I did the second one, I don't think about my hair anymore. Yeah. Because the hair used to be constantly in my mind, how mm -hmm. I present myself to mm -hmm. other people at work. Yeah. I have fun going to like parties mm -hmm. and events because of my hair. But now hair is not. You're not like, worried about it. Yeah. Something I have to think about, yeah. you know. Yeah. I just move on to my other things. Yeah. I yeah. Get up and go because now I have the hair. It's no longer one yeah. of the problems I have to deal with. Right. And a lot of people thought you were um, a little insane going for another hair transplant when they saw your oh. result, right? <laughs> From the first procedure. <laughs> Not insane, but they were like, what is she doing? Yes. Uh, <laughs> I got some crazy comments. People told me to, to go and sit somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> They're maybe just yelling, you know, you got such a great result, but why, when you see this, and this is why we're doing this video, because now you can see what two coats of paint is, if you will. Yeah. Every time you do a procedure, 30, 35% each time. So you were saying, and I know you said this in your video as well, that it's almost like too thick at this point, right? To, to look natural. It almost is like too, too much, but I think it matches the rest of your hair being so thick. Yeah, it, it does match... Um, the rest of my hair because the rest of my hair is thicker but if I was somebody that had like maybe fine hair mm -hmm. it would have been okay the first procedure would have been okay but I think that whether you go for a first or second transplant also has to do with the hair that you originally right. have right. like for instance if you were to have a hair transplant <laughs> you... I would need two <laughs> I know I would need two because I'm used to having thick hair everywhere so you're right I yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So it depends on what you have originally, and then you want to kind of. That's true. That's yeah. true. Do you have yeah. any issues in terms of hiding the scar in the back? No, it's okay. not a problem. Okay. Like I can find it. I can okay. find the first or the second one. Okay. Good. One of the questions that I get a lot of people are asking me if I had experienced keloid mm -hmm. or something like that. Mm -hmm. So yep. I never about it because mm -hmm. I have never experienced it. Right, right. Some people, there's a, there are a, a small mo a minority of people that do get keloids, which is this, this raised scar. Um, yeah. And yeah, but fortunately you don't have those, and, and uh, but those can be an issue for certain people. But I think yeah. even if you had it, you, you know, as thick as your hair is, you probably still wouldn't see it. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I can't find the first scar, and I can't yeah. find the second one. Perfect. And Feel it. You know, sometimes you can feel it. I can't even feel it. Yep. So awesome. It, it never sense. happened. <laughs> would you do the second procedure again if you could? If you could go back in time, would you tell the past Matiana go ahead and go for it? Yeah, I would have. So what I was thinking is, if I had the knowledge that I have now, or if somebody had told me, I would have planned for the first procedure with a year yep. or a year half, and then do the second one. Okay. Okay. But I because I was new to it. Right. But with all the knowledge that I have, I would have yeah. to play for both. Right, right. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Well, why don't we model your hair a little bit? Um, I can see you from the front. Maybe you could yeah. just put your chin down for it a little. Yep, perfect. Just kind of model. Right. Yep, that looks great. And then maybe we can have you turn to one side or the other. 
Uh, and just hold it there. Perfect. Stay right there. Oh, look at that. Look how natural that curve looks. And then let's do the other side, same way. Yeah, and we'll do your left side. Perfect. Yeah, you can pull back if you want. Perfect. Amazing. Look at that. That's all new hair. Two passes. Can't imagine you having thicker hair, needing thicker hair than that. That's like, <laughs> really blends in nicely. So, yeah. awesome. I made it. I finally made it. Congratulations. And just don't go back to those traction hairstyles. Love your hair. Take care of it. And you'll have this for life. It's going to be awesome. So, yeah. Awesome. Good. Thank you for um, updating everyone about your progress per on your personal page, and, uh, and thanks again for showing showing everyone this video. Uh, Thank you. Good to see you again. All right, <laughs> take care. Bye. Bye. Call us now, 844-327-4247, and ask about our Hue and Hue Plus procedures, which move more hair than ever before. Hope to hear from you soon.